Aisha, this trend that we're seeing is people moving from New York City into Connecticut, and those experts say it really has turned parts of Connecticut in from a buyer's to now a seller's market. I've been in the business for 30 years, and I've seen a market I have never seen before from a demand standpoint. The buyer and rental activity coming out of New York City has, is unprecedented. Paul Brunick says William Pitt Sotheby's 27 offices in Westchester, Connecticut, and the Berkshires have seen New York buyers make up 46% of business in Westchester, 33% in Fairfield County, 31% in Litchfield County, 9% on the Connecticut shoreline, and 35% in Berkshire County, something we haven't seen before. He says there's a shift in the market we haven't seen in 12 to 15 years with people leaving the cities for the suburbs. He attributes that to the pandemic and people's basic need for shelter. Working at home now is acceptable. And also people are concerned in New York City that they're not going to be able to send their kids to school um, for the fall semester. And that's playing into it. And they want to get settled and situated in another area and get in the school system and get their kids acclimated. He says right now, if a home is priced right and turnkey, it's getting its asking price and sometimes multiple offers. Robert Russo is a real estate attorney in Southport and says where we were seeing prices comparable to when homes sold in the late 90s, they're now back to their 2007 price peaks. We assumed when the pandemic launched that it would mean that the real estate market was going to grind to a halt. And we were totally wrong. Instead, uh, real estate prices right now are the best we've seen in 13 or 14 years. He says the rental market is also surging. You have a lot of people from Manhattan that are looking to get out and looking to go to some place that, that has all their summer activities contained in, and that is. As to where the market will go, there are differing opinions on whether this surge will continue or level out in a few months. But one thing is for sure, in an unprecedented pandemic, it's an unprecedented market. It has been truly amazing how the banks, the realtors, and the attorneys have all worked together to get this done. So what does this all mean for us here in Connecticut? Well, if you're a seller, the experts are saying if you price your house right, you'll probably get an offer pretty quickly. Some of them are going just in a matter of days. For buyers, it's going to be interesting to see what happens if you want to buy right now and there are houses on the market. They are saying that you might have to be very aggressive in your offer and many are getting full price or you can wait it out and you can see what happens with market. Back to you.